All right, let's go over to wide receiver now, and let's start off with the new Las Vegas Raider, Devontae Adams. He is priced at 8100 over on DraftKings this week. Justin Jefferson is at 7800 my guy Debo, 7,400 for the 49ers. Jamar Chase going against Pittsburgh, 7,100. Keenan Allen of the Chargers going against the Raiders at 7,000. And then Tyreek Hill, a fantasy week of under 7,000 for Tyreek Hill. He must be on a new team this year. Oh, that's right. He's on Miami, 6,800 for Tyreek. I mean, doesn't your doesn't your eye just immediately drift to Tyreek Hill at 6,800? And you're like, Really? That Tyreek Hill, the Tyreek Hill that can score from anywhere, that can wave at a defender, that can just like it's like it's like the guy does magic when he's out there and he's sixty eight hundred, he's less than Keenan Allen. Just and and by the way, I mean this is also reflected in our projected ownership on dailyroto.com as well. It's not as if the market is looking at him at sixty eight hundred in this game against the Patriots and saying, like, oh, we we better play this guy. No, we have uh, Keenan Allen expected to be on more rosters. We have Jamar Chase and Justin Jefferson is the two most mm-hmm. popular wide receivers of the week. Mike Williams is getting in there. And on, on the lower end, we also have, uh, well, we did have Rondell Moore as a very popular play because of the suspension to Hopkins and that matchup for the Cardinals. But now it's like Andy Isabella's minimum salary. Greg Dorch is minimum salary. I mean, people might play A.J. Green because the, the Cardinals are six-point dogs here. Like, they're going to have to throw. Zach Ertz might not play. So there are a lot of wide receivers out there that are just going to lead to people forgetting about Tyreek Hill. I mean, Juju Smith-Schuster at 5,200 is going to be really popular. Michael Pittman at 5,500. Again, if we're just looking at where guys were drafted and their week one salaries, you know, Michael Pittman was going ahead of Keenan Allen and he's $1,500 cheaper. So he's going to be super popular. I, I would say my my certain, my wide receiver, uh, you know, kind of dart throw heart, pick of the week is definitely Andy Isabella with Rondell Moore out. I mean, I thought he was going to be so good, Craig. I thought Andy Isabella was just going to, I thought he was going to be so good. This might be the last chance in his career to show anything. Like I, I don't really see how they get away from playing him this week because Rondell's out. Hopkins is out. Antoine Wesley, who they played last year is out. He's, he's actually on the IR. Like they're just going to have to play him. 